I'd like you to think this week of the last time someone winked at you, or indeed you winked at someone else. Because this week I've got some really interesting research that shows that we have to be really careful when winking at other people, because it can be interpreted in so many different ways. My name is Jonathan Bradshaw and welcome to this week's Metology Minute. Yes, this week, the strange behavioural phenomenon, that is winking. Why do we choose to shut our eye and open it very quickly, sometimes, when we're interacting with other people? Well, the reason I'm looking into this is because of an email I received a few weeks ago asking me whether I was aware that at the end of quite a few of these Metology Minutes, I tended to do a quick wink. And the answer is that certainly on some occasions I did, but certainly on other occasions I definitely wasn't. So I looked into some of the research behind this phenomenon. Now, there's not a lot out there, but there's one study I want to focus on from psychologists at New Mexico State University from 2009. In the research, they asked people to go up to random strangers on a college campus outside a shopping mall and ask them for the time. And then when they'd been asked the time, the researchers, the people, the actors, were asked just to quickly wink at the person who'd given them the time of day. Now, as these people, the people that gave given the time walked off, they were grabbed by a researcher and asked, what did they think of that person, the questioner, winking at them after they'd asked the question? Now, what's interesting here is the range of responses, and that's the whole crux of this week's insight. You and I have to be careful if and when we wink, because we're absolutely not going to be in control of how it is perceived by the receiver of the wink. On the positive side, some of the people questioned said that when this person winked at them, it was positive, it was friendly, it was probably a thank you for giving them the time. Some people thought it was romantically flirtatious. Now that might be okay if that's your goal, but if it's not, that could cause real problems. And lower down the spectrum of positivity, some people thought there was definitely an ulterior motive. Some people thought the person was trying to be cool. And perhaps most hilariously, and probably negatively, some people thought the person who was asking the questions must have an eye problem. Now that's not what we want to put across. I haven't got an eye problem, I'm sure, I hope. Um, but that's not why I wink. So this week, just be careful and look out for this more and more. Turn that radar on. It's a behaviour that's, um, I think, perhaps becoming less common. But this week, have a look. Do people wink at you? How does it make you feel? Are you winking at other people? How does it make them feel themselves? Because that's the important thing. Remember, as always, if you want to receive these weekly Meetology Minutes, head over to Meetology.com where you can sign up to receive them. And I'll be back in seven days with another Meetology Minute exploring the fascinating science powering world-class people skills. I'll see you in a week's time. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.